Namaste. On this special occasion of the International Year of Millet 2023, I look forward to talk about the importance of millet. Did you know millets are one of the oldest food known to humankind? This ancient grain has not only been used for our consumption, but also as animal feed. Although, scientifically speaking, millets are small seeded cereal grains that belong to the grass family and are grown widely across the world. Millet crops are pest resistant and need less water for cultivation. According to their size, they are grouped into two, two uh, categories, major millets and minor millets. Major millets are millets such as pearl, sorghum and finger millets, and minor millets are foxtail, podo, barnyard, little and kosher millets. However, there are two pseudo millets, amaranth and buckwheat. The traditional grain of India is millets. Now we know a little about millets. Do you know who the largest producer is? You guessed it right, it's India. India is exporting millets to 139 countries across the globe in 2023. So, why must we include millets in our daily diet? Because they're superfoods. They are rich in macronutrients such as proteins and fats, and micronutrients such as iron and calcium. They are rich in fiber and are gluten-free and have a low GI. They guard us against many vitamin and mineral deficiencies. They are enriched with the goodness of magnesium, which can effectively reduce the risk of high blood pressure, heart attack, and stroke. People need to gain awareness of the benefits of millets. Millets are not only healthy, but have unique taste that can accentuate the taste quotient of any meal. Many have forgotten how to cook them. They can be used as a substitute for rice in almost any rice-based dish. They can be prepared as porridge for growing kids and aging adults. Recently, our Honorable Prime Minister Narendra Modi made India lead in making yoga a global phenomenon and similarly promotes millets for global benefits. The Parliament of India has already added millets to their canteen menu to promote its consumption and to honor the year of millets. These are, these are just some of the millets that we use in our house regularly. And today my mom made a dish out of kodo millets. I hope we consume millets every, uh, de regularly. I hope you do too. Thank you for listening to my speech. I hope you found it useful and I hope it inf inspires you to make millets in your house. Thank you. Namaste.